Hello coolers, welcome back to another interesting episode of Viva Barca, the home of everything Barca, where we are going to be discussing on the latest as usual. We are going to start with Frankie the Young and his future. Of course, Arsenal have reportedly just entered the race for Frankie the Young. Of course, Man United have been the most talked about um, club that have been linked with Frankie the Young and recent reports are claiming that Arsenal have also entered a bid to sign the Man United link Barcelona midfielder. We are going to be discussing much on that as we move ahead. Then to conclude, talking about outcast defender Samuel Umtiti, it has been reported that French club OGC Nice have been contacting Umtiti over a move and they want the Barca defender to terminate his contract and join them for free. We are also going to be looking at that report. So guys, as we get right into those stories in more detail, please endeavor to subscribe to this channel. If you haven't subscribed, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Give the video a like and make sure to watch the video right up to the very end. Barca, Barca, Barca. Despite Frankie the Young making it clear that he wishes to stay put at Barcelona beyond the summer, speculations linking him with an exit continue to do the rounds. Barcelona for their part have not, you know, definitively ruled out the exit of the 25-year-old as the club find themselves in a precarious financial situation. And should a bid of around 85 million euros arrive, Barcelona would be open to the prospect of offloading the Dutchman. Manchester United have been linked the strongest with a move for the young. Now managed manager Eric Den Haag. Of course, who is now their coach, wants the midfield. Um, the Red Devils are leaving no stone unturned in their pursuit of Frankie de Jong. However, according to the Mirror via Sport, Manchester United are now set to face competition from Premier League rivals Arsenal in the race to sign de Jong from Barcelona. De Jong had previously made a statement back in 2019 when he had claimed that he wanted to follow the pathway of Dutch legend Mark Overmars and go from Ajax to Arsenal and then from to Barcelona. However, the 25-year-old skipped a step and ended up joining Barcelona directly. Arsenal are now showing an interest in signing the former Ajax prodigy, although any move, you know, would be difficult to pull off. Firstly, the young has, on multiple occasions, made it clear that he wishes to continue at the Camp Nou. On top of that, if he were to move, the young would want to play in the Champions League. But neither Manchester United nor Arsenal have qualified for the Europe's Premier competition for the upcoming season. So even though Barcelona have not exactly closed the door on an exit for the young, it will take massive efforts from Arsenal and Manchester United to convince the midfielder to depart in the summer transfer window. Then on to the next story of discussion, Barcelona may have found a way to get rid of out of favor defender Samuel Umtiti in the summer transfer window, with French club OGC Nice emerging as a potential destination. As reported by Sport, Nice are interested in signing Umtiti from Barcelona in the upcoming transfer window. However, they would only consider a move if the Frenchman terminates his contract with Barca and becomes available for free. Umtiti has been out of favor at Camp Nou you know, for the last couple of seasons, with Barca eyeing more defensive reinforcements. The 28 um, year old prospect will only get worse from year on. The 2018 FIFA World Cup winner played just once all season in 2021-22 and struggle with injuries for the most part of the campaign. Given the situation, an exit would be the best possible sol solution for all parties involved, and needs are ready to provide Umtiti with an escape route from Camp Nou. To that end, they have established contact with the defenders and entourage to inform them of their interest and ask them to negotiate with Barcelona over giving the 28-year-old a letter of freedom. If he becomes available for free, the Lyon outfit will be willing to offer the centre half a contract with fixed and variable components containing performance-related bonuses, keeping in mind his physical problems. 
Um, Barcelona for their part are desperate to get Umtiti off their books as they look to clear out his salary from the wage bill and they will be open to any sort of arrangement as long as they can make room for their payroll by offloading Samuel Umtiti. Ideally, Barcelona would prefer selling Umtiti outright but would be open to a loan as to the loan exit as well. You know, it however remains to be seen whether they would terminate his contract and let him leave for free. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, endeavor to do so so you always stay in touch with the latest NFC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, it's bye for now.